Welcome to my first gaming video. I decided not to do Ultra EO, mainly because I fucked up my recording on it. I, inst I clicked ending instead. It's like a 15 minute video. So we're going to do this visual novel. This video is all I found. And I also downloaded another game called A Girl Adrift. It's a idle game, just like Ultra Ego. But let's do this. Let's get back into it. What am I? Whoa. Why do you live? That's some real hard questions. This dream again. Alright, he's getting ready for school. I believe that. Got the subway. The incoming train is heading uptown. Ugh, I'm so sleepy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna read everybody's lines. Hmm. Linda, you're still not looking very well. It makes sense. I feel sorry for her. Hey, Luke, are you sleepwalking schools this way? Yawn, what is it? Oh, it's you. I'm so tired. Luke, stop sleeping. Wake up. Emerson's at is throwing, is throwing another fit. We have to go. Oh, but I'm so sleepy. I'm seriously going to crush him this time. Hoodie is lone again. Glass is not t talking again. Kids, let's go home. Daddy need to be home soon. Really? Hurry, hurry, hurry. No, I don't want to go. No, no, I don't want to. Don't go alone. I didn't say a word today again. Why do I... Why do I live? No one cares about me. Right, maybe I'll try to talk to the kids. Kids stutter... I get to fucking read it. Ah, let's go home. He's gonna pass out on the train. Misses stop. I don't even though I've never had that feeling before. Doors closing. The doors closing. <gasps> Wait, I passed my station. I'm getting off. Wait. Uh, wait, where am I? I've never seen this station before. Um, what do I do? Let's look for a sign. I'm sure there are some people like me, so there must be a sign somewhere. You found a sign next to the exit. What time is it? Uh, that was the last subway. I should go outside and walk home. You walked to the station's attendant office. Yes, this. Yes, patrolling. The attendants are still working? That's a relief. Uh, excuse me. Uh, sh I'm sure I heard a voice. How come no one's answering? Excuse me? God damn. Ah! I'm not gonna fucking do that. You started running towards the export even, even thinking, Ah, it's following me, ah! The light! I'm alive! I'm alive! What was that? Was it a ghost? Ah, I have to get out of here. Where's the exit? Help me. Ah. Oh, he died. Oh, he died. <laughs> Ouch, huh? What was that just now? Why am I passed outside the, passed out, outside the station? I couldn't get out because of the shutter. Wait, is that me passed out inside the shutter? Huh, wait, what? What's going on? Is it beating? Huh, wait, what? What's going on? Oh, that'd be fucking scary to see. What's that smell? Ooh, is your heart beating? It's not a human being. 
Yes, I can hear it. The monsters came a step closer. I put it in my mouth so no one can smell it and chew it and chew it. What's going on? It's hard. It's thump, 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 thump. I'm so jealous. The monster came another step closer. It's mine. Mine. It smells so delicious and fresh meat. I want it. Stop. Thump, thump, thump. I want it too. Thump, too. I want it too. Oh, it. No, go away. Start running even before thinking, thinking, is no one here? Help. I want to smell it and taste it and chew its nails. It's thump, thump, thumping again. I'm so jealous. I want a heart, heart, heart. So I end up dying like this, or I don't want to die like this. I don't want to die like this. It took so long to find you to keep running around. Song grit. How far are you planning to go? Your sister's gonna die if you continue doing so. Ooh. Get down. Do not look up or you'll get your head chopped off. Something sharp passed by your ears. Well, that's cool. Surprise. It's not gonna kill them or anything, but it'll give us some time. Get up. Who are you? You're asking who I am. You're not questioning about your body. You're right, my body. Your body is fine. Another ghost should be protecting it. Follow me. I'll take you there. Uh, okay. You came so far. Six. You follow the shady person. I guess he's pissed off because we ran. A few moments later. Hey, you're okay. Ooh. Who's this? Probably not a human being. Not, not probably not a human again, right? Thought me to collect the scattered species. It was close. It's good enough. We don't have to take care of it. Just as if you enjoyed that. What's going on? Why should I take care of something that's still alive? Never mind with the nonsense. We're returning to the office. All right, let's go. You're coming with us. What well, me? Your body's inside. It's okay. We're ghosts from the underworld office. We don't hurt people usually. The underworld office. What do you think this is? If you don't want to trust that you can live like that forever, take us with you, boss. Sorry for scan scaring you earlier. Usually people faint as soon as they s see my face. That was you? Oh, yes, and the ghosts usually when people faint like that. The office attendants find you the next day and send you back home. We'd expect you to run all the way to the border that separates the mortal and the underworld, but. <laughs> I said, I'm sorry. There are nicer ghosts inside. Maybe you could just try it. You could try escaping your way out by playing nice. Who knows? Maybe maybe they'll stop us from doing from harming you if we decide to do so. Are you going to hurt me? I'm kidding. <laughs> Am I going to be okay? Attendant's office it feels a bit different from earlier. It feels colorless. There are two more ghosts inside the office. Hi, hello, hi. What is it? What's a toddler like you doing here? These ghosts aren't as scary as the ones from earlier. Hello, sit anywhere you'd like. We haven't unpacked the chairs yet. But ghosts don't really care about comfort, you know. Just sit. We're only pretending to be sitting anyways. River, do you not feel like leaving yet? Nope. You were aggravating. Anyway, what's your name? Um, it's Eugene. Nice to meet you, Eugene. You're in the underworld armor, so we help people with ghost problems. Forever, shut your mouth. That's a friendly ghost. You just call, call him Boss. I am River. That granny over there is John. The baby is Hayden. If I'm Hayden, you're Eugene. Yay, Hayden, you're my friend now. What's wrong? Not a friend yet, Hayden. Oh, that was fast. Take us some time to become true friends. We'll roll in some mud together and see if we ch see each other's sides and bad sides. And someday you two will find we'll be friends before you even realize. Isn't that right? That's right. Old words are wise words. That's right, but you can't be friends with anyone. Having bad friends are worse than not having one. Like a boss who pretends to be normal, now she isn't inside. Right, Eugene? Eugene, maybe your prescription expired. How bad are your eyes? I seriously saw your mouth shut. 
Ross really need to talk like that in front of a child. Eugene's literally been next to the entrance in the uh, next to the uh, next to the world. <laughs> you scared the kid even more, you moron. <laughs> For you on the next world because you were dead, your soul would just be the color of shadows just like us. The outside is not the next world. The world is much harder to go beyond that. We are at the border from the mortal world, the next world. All souls prepare to go beyond the border at this place. I thought everything was over if I die. <laughs> Let her finish her words. If you let go of all your regrets and pay back your former misdeeds, your entire body turned to light. No shadows. And they just disappear. We don't know for sure, but it's probably hell or heaven. Or if that's not the case, they have to live here forever. Hayden doesn't have many wrongdoings, so Hayden can leave soon. Kids these days talk about misdeeds and wrongdoing back in my days. Now, not that I want to leave right now, though. You know, I mean, unless you would like to wander around forever, it means that you st you may need. You need to pay back all the misdeeds you have made. Pay back the kindness you have received. How, if you did something bad to another person stacked up misdeeds, they either get punished or help someone out and make it up for it. If you got help from others, you must return their kindness through helping back. It's called karma. Personally, I like paying back the harms even much more. You're usually doing them. He's just talking trash. Don't listen to him. Uh, um, if I wish misdeeds didn't stack up if I was discreet, but... Everything in the world is somehow connected. So things can stack up. So things can't. Nah! So things stack up even if nobody can see what you were doing. Why are you telling me all this? How oh, you're fast and thus? You also have some debt to pay back to me. What? I see you from those monsters. I left you there, they would have taken over your body, then you would have wandered around this horrible place as neither a mortal or a ghost. Really? Thank you. Eugenia's manners, but debt? This kindness for saving someone's life is extreme significant. It'd be hard to pay back after you're dead, so I suggest you start paying back now. But how? Actually, about that, how does a mortal pay back their debt, boss? You're not to be. I do not want to be involved in morals, but since Eugene's already dead, I have to be paid back. It's nothing to be done. Work at the Underworld office to pay back your debt. What? Oh. Yay. Everyone quiet. Boss, really? Work. What kind of work? See, motivated. I have a lot of misdeeds to pay back. I've been paying back my debt by taking care of monsters. I collect other ghosts in similar situations and open this office, but monsters have noticed that and hidden people's dreams. To find all of them, I can borrow some hands. If you help me out three times, I'll forgive your debt. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm totally in. I have a friend now. Back in my days, you, pat you paid back your debt for your life. All these kids these days pay their lives for their debt. What a world we live in. Boss is the oldest here, you know, John. <laughs> what do we call you now, intern? Words these days are not as catchy. You call him our junior. Don't call him newbie. I don't even know what's going on, but I think I got myself in some trouble. Do you have any questions, junior? Uh, uh, yes, yes I do. Curiosity is a good thing. Hold them back for now. You will, you will get to figure them out as you go. Boss snapped his fingers, your eyes suddenly blacked out. <gasps> Panting. Where did everyone I'm still at the same work on this. Am I back in reality? All that just now was it just a dream? Alright. Ah! There's a sign we go there's a sign we go back down the platform, call a number written on there. The station attendant will come get you. I'll see you in your dreams tomorrow. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Gravery disappeared. what's gonna happen to me now? Chapter one, Eugene. They go I think I'm doing like, all right on that note we're gonna end it there we'll start chapter two and probably next week
I hope this is good. It's my first video. Because I want to make my channel variety content, not just Deku as and all that. And if I can get someone to make me an intro and an outro, that would be great. Did not mean to click it, but I'll come back to this later. The next week, actually. So, see you guys then. Bye-bye.